Now, more than ever, we know kids are struggling with the isolation of the pandemic and a whole range of emotions that are hard to express. But my next guest wants to help parents help their kids find their words in a new way. So please welcome parenting expert and author of Dear Me, Donna Tatro. Donna, welcome to the show. Hi, thanks so much for having me. Donna, you say we need to become and teach our kids to become emotional scientists. So what does that exactly mean? Well, that term emotional scientist really comes from Dr. Mark Brackett. He's at Yale. He heads up the Emotional Intelligence Center there. And his work focuses on getting kids and families to think about their emotions and to think about others' emotions. And so he came up with this um, acronym, RULER, to teach this. And what he wants to teach is to recognize our emotions, understand our emotions, label them, express your emotions, and then regulate and manage your emotions. And so this is his way he believes, and it's research-based, that we can have better mental health and really change the trajectory of our lives in a positive way. So Don, I know one of the ways you've phrase this or address this is you've said our system actually needs an overhaul when it comes to literacy. So spell that out for us. What needs to change? So really, it needs to get into our classrooms. We need to have this curriculum built into our classrooms. This is considered a soft skill. It should no longer be considered that. And I also really believe that it needs to be within our parenting. We need to teach this in our families to grow healthier, families and healthier kids. Well, Donna, you, you're actually tackling this emotional literacy with your new book. So tell us about Dear Me. So Dear Me starts off with, I am a happy little boy. Well, most of the time, we're not happy all of the time, right? So in that page, he is showing that he's identifying his feeling as being happy. And then when you move on into the next scene, you're seeing that he sees more emotions and he's naming more emotions, frustration, he's scared, he's angry, he's sad, and he begins to journal. He begins to use these tools that we're teaching. And so it teaches kids that they can move through their emotions and then create more positive emotions. And it's kind of funny. I mean, I've written this book and I've edited it and I've read it over and over again. And there are a lot of times where I'll feel frustrated or anxious or upset. And I'll just say to myself, dear Donna. And so <laughs> I think that parents can actually use this book as yeah. well to remember Dear mom, dear dad, you know, it's okay to feel your emotions too. All right, dear Donna. <laughs> I understand that your book, Dear Me, is out. Yes, I'm so excited. I can't wait for kids and parents to get a hold of it and work toward better mental health. Well, congratulations and kudos to you. It's a smart book. It's available now on Amazon and just about anywhere books are sold. As always, thank you so much, Donna, for joining us. Thank you, Donna. Thank you so much for having me. It was nice to see you.